Hi, I'm Carmen Shamas. I'm going to talk about Wednesday, the 30th of October. Today, the moon is in Sagittarius, tomorrow also. So the last two days of October, the moon will be in Sagittarius, which means that you have uh, two favorable days if you are Sagittarius, if you are Aries, and if you are uh, Leo. So uh, the, the, the time is perfect if you want to move on and to really uh, wrap it up. However, how, it is, how is it going to be for all signs? So let's start with Aries. Aries, definitely today is a good day to move on. Definitely it's a bright day if you want to have a plan, if you want to put a plan, if you want to implement a plan. Today you can be daring and today you can really show everybody that you can make it and you are capable and that you are qualified. Everybody can be um, lucky today, especially those born in the month of March and those born on the 12th. 13th 14th of april let's move on to taurus taurus definitely today today is a relief you have been through two uh, tough days um, uh, monday and tuesday so today is a relief and today definitely you need to start working on a serious plan if you want to cross to uh, November in a perfect way. So don't waste your time. Try to amend, try to make things right again. Try to move in the right direction. You may need to be more flexible or you need to be flexible in order to really cross and reach the safe side. Um, ask for legal help, for professional help. Don't be um, embarrassed. So the most tired are those born on the 24th, 25th, even the 26th of April. Uh, whereas the luckiest uh, can be those born on the 5th, 6th, 12th, 13th of May. Okay, so let's move on to Gemini. I've been telling you, Gemini, for the past two days that today is not a good day to wrap the month up. So today you may feel under pressure. Today you may feel that you have to uh, present results and that today you need to do something about something. So today is not a perfect day to pick a fight. What you have to do is be completely open to new different ideas and be completely ready to negotiate or even to give and take. So it's not uh, an easy day to force your own ideas and beliefs. Uh, you can be a bit uh, tired or stressed out if you were born in the month of uh, May. Let's move on to Cancer. Cancer today, the moon is in Sagittarius. It's the sixth house uh, in your chart, which means it's uh, it's the time for you to plan your day ahead, maybe very early on. Maybe you have to work uh, or put on more efforts or put more um, work hours. So it's a long day. Yes, uh, this is true. And you may feel tired. You may feel a little bit tired or you may feel a little bit overwhelmed with the chores because they are like uh, all they come all together and you may feel that you really need to multitask which is okay as long as you are really moving in a certain agenda or in a certain schedule what you have to do is uh, uh, be well aware of your duties and of uh, your uh, uh, deadlines so it's not a bad day it's a long day knowing that the sun in scorpio is helping you out the luckiest are those born in the month of June. So let's move on to Leo. Leo, it's a very nice day. It's a good time to sort out your feelings. It's a good day to um, uh, explore what you really want to do. It's a great day if you want to specify and declare uh, or make a declaration or anything. So today is a very nice day for um, Leos to show off also. Um, what is important in today, Wednesday, is that you should really make things work out. You really need, really need to make ends meet, knowing that the past two days were not that easy. So today is your chance to make things right again, and it's a lucky day. The luckiest are those born in the month of uh, July, and also those born between the 15th and the 17th of August.
Let's move on to Virgo. Virgo, you can be uh, very special today with the moon in Sagittarius. Most probably you're trying to negotiate something related to your um, house, maybe house repairs or furniture or decoration or anything. Today you may also be moving in or moving out, traveling in, traveling out. You may be celebrating something. You may be, you may feel a little bit at unease or you may feel just um, uh, comfortable enough to stay at home with a cup of coffee with a cup of tea and doing some yoga doing some meditation or detoxing so it's all kinds kind of things today for virgos just to make you feel and uh, to put yourself in a very calm situation uh, or conditions on the practical side it can be a bit um, um a, a bit um, uh, busy so today it's a busy day uh, maybe you prefer to take your stuff your your work to a quiet corner to a quiet desk to the library just to concentrate but remember it's not a negative day the luckiest are those born on the 27th 28th of august also those born on the 8th 9th 15th 16th of september I move on to Libra. Libra with the moon in Sagittarius, it empowers your mental uh, mental power, let's say. It empowers you. It, um, it sparks, it gives you some sparks, mental sparks. That's why you will come up with great, brilliant ideas today. There's no stopping you, uh, Libra, and today is a beautiful day to show off uh, whatever qualifications you have, whatever new merits you have. So today, Libra, uh, you are really uh, capable of uh, proving them all wrong. Uh, however, you have to know that planet Mars is still in your sign and that's why it may attract problems. It may attract negative people to your day. It may attract conflicts. It may attract those who challenge you and provoke you, maybe just to make you fall in the trap of being uh, manipulative or being a bit bossy. So you have to watch out. Planet Mars uh, warns you if you were born on the 9th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th or even 12th of October to be very careful and to be as peaceful as positive, as positive as, pos as possible and also to drive carefully. Let's move on to Scorpio with the moon in uh, Sagittarius in the house of money. You are so strong. You are so powerful. You are so brilliant. You are so capable of moving on with big strides. So you are now galloping. You are like a horse. You're galloping. You're moving fast. Planet Venus is about to say goodbye. So this means that you still have today and tomorrow to try to make the best of it. You are still a winner. You are still perfect um, in whatever situation you are. Planet Venus now brings great uh, vibes, great luck to those born on the between the 20th and the 22nd of November. Everybody can be lucky today. Let's move on to uh, Sagittarius. With the moon in your sign, Sagittarians, you are very powerful today. But mind you, this is not a very long uh, situation. It's temporary because the sun is in Scorpio, which means that you will be uh, a bit in the uh, in the shade or in the shadows or whatever it is uh, until the 22nd of uh, November. Every now and then you will get a good chance, like maybe once a week you get a chance to uh, a breakthrough and that's why you really need to move when it's really good. So today is good. The sun, is, the moon is in your sign tomorrow also. So this is the right time to make a move and this is a best time to wrap the month or the week even. So uh, actually between today and tomorrow you'll be able to define certain things and you'll be able to get results unlike any other day so today is a good day most probably the phone will ring maybe you'll get notifications the emails answers whatever between today and tomorrow so today basically you can be quite lucky and the luckiest are those born um, on the 14th 15th or even 16th of December
I move on to Capricorn. Capricorn, today is a day you just sit at the office, at your desk, um, or at home, or whatever you are, at school, uni, wherever you are, to um, just sit and, uh, and think about your life where you are, where you've been, where you're going. Today actually is a very slow day. It's not a very productive day. That's why you should not put yourself in a difficult situation. You should be working on routine stuff, on your routine cases. You don't want to um, involve yourself in difficult uh, uh, tasks. So, and also you really need to watch out because today can be very disappointing and very, very, very frustrating, especially if you were born in the month of January. Let's move on to Aquarius. Aquarius, it's, uh, it's a bit fruitful. It's uh, efficient in a way if you ask for help, if you want to work on your own, most probably you stay where you are. If you ask for help, if you join efforts, if you work in a team, if you join a team, most probably you're going to make a good result. And this is why today is a good day to socialize and to lobby around. So don't stay on your own and try to wrap the month of October. The luckiest are those born uh, between the 1st and the 10th of February. Pisces, it's, um, it's a very nice day. Actually, it can be a very, very, very important day in your career um, or even in your life because today you are under the spotlights. You are really, um, um, really, you can be a star. You can be amazing. However, you have to be ready for that. You have to earn it. Uh, but at least you have the opportunity to do that. So please be ready, Pisces. Um, don't be afraid. Don't be embarrassed. Don't be shy. You have to be strong. You have to be self-confident. You have to walk in with big strides, with your chin up, because you can do it. You are wonderful. And today is a great day. Although it can be a bit tense, However, it's a good day for you. The luckiest are those born between the 25th and 28th of February. So this is it for Wednesday, the 30th of October. I wish you all a great, great, great day and see you tomorrow every day at uh, 3 p.m. Universal Time. Uh, I upload the video. So see you then. Bye bye.